Okay, people, I just had to do this video. It's time to tear this. I don't really even know what to think. It's time to tear this lady apart. Okay, apparently, there's this, this well-known couple here on YouTube by the name of Chris and Quinn you see here. And apparently, there's some background context to this video here. Chris had played this masterful prank on Queen here, as you see right here, and she wanted to get him back by pretending that she had an abortion some months back. That was her master plan to get him back. Now let's scroll down here and see what she said. She says, I see a lot of people mad in these comments when this is clearly a prank. A prank is not meant to be funny. A prank is to get a reaction out of someone. I don't believe in abortion anyway, so please get your pennies out of the bunch. Thanks. Queen speaking. Okay. The whole problem I have with this is very, very simple. We have this ridiculous cavalier attitude about how we look at abortion. Even people who supposedly don't believe in it, like Queen says here, has this very, very cavalier attitude, this very, very nonchalant attitude in how she looks at it. Why in the world would she play around with this in this way? I mean, let's think about this for a second. There are certain things you just don't prank with. I don't care if you're trying to get a reaction out of somebody. There are certain things you don't prank with. Well, she said, well, I don't believe in rape, but I'm going to plan a prank and make it seem like a rape happened when it really didn't. I mean, would you play a prank like that with rape? or pretending like a rape happened or, or try to find a way to prank like that? I mean, think about this. Nobody who's rational, and for good reason, would think something like that is okay, that you would play around with the subject of rape. But for some reason, they think murder in their own child is a different case. We are so stuck on having this just nonchalant attitude, even if we claim to be against abortion and don't believe in it. People have been so thoroughly brainwashed in this society with politically correct nonsense that even when they pretend or say that they don't believe in it, they'll undermine it and undersell it, and just downplay it. This is absolutely sickening to me. I don't understand where this source of, where this sort of attitude comes from to where you'll, you, you'll think that maybe, possibly, abortion is murder. If you actually think abortion is actually murder, but then you'll prank with it? Come on, you will never do that with rape. I don't care what the context is. I don't care if it's to get somebody back for a prank. You wouldn't play with that, but it's okay to play with killing children, especially when you claim you don't believe in it. Would you pretend to have killed a born child? Would you try to get a little kid to participate in such a prank? This is sick. There are certain lines you just don't cross. I don't give a crap how many subs she got, how well known she is. She needs to get her head out the gutter. This is insane. How about well, you don't believe in it? No, it's the fact that you've been so thoroughly brainwashed with this garbage in our society that you 
directly or indirectly undermine it. So you think you can trench on that ground. You think you can cross that line, and that's perfectly fine. But it's not okay to do something like that. Right. Because I'm pretty sure with every being with every bit in me that she would never, you know, turn to the first thing in her mind to um put together a prank about rape. I just don't see it happening. Playing around with abortion, come on. And if she truly claims that she doesn't believe in it and she doesn't like and hate the slaughter of 3,000 on average a day, if that truly bothers her, then she wouldn't have done this. But she goes out of her way to do this for views and YouTube money. You will pretend to joke about a very serious subject of murdering children when you claim you don't believe in it just so you can get views in YouTube money. Disgusting. Just fly out disgusting. What goes around comes around, people. I don't know if this girl, this woman is a Christian or if she's even a theist or anything like that, but whatever the case may be, whether she is or not, she needs to repent. This is, I, 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 I'm, I'm done. I'm just going, this video is just going to go on or if I continue to write any further. So I'm just going to cut it short here and just, yeah. I, I just had to get that off my chest, my friends. This is sick. I appreciate y'all watching. And take care. God bless. Peace.